Hi children, we are talking about me and my family. Now let's look at, it's very interesting for you to ask your paternal grandparent and maternal grandparents, ask your parents and draw up your family tree. It's very interesting. So now we are going to look at the family tree. Okay, let's draw, let's draw, whatever. Family. Family tree. Alright. Now you also do your own family tree. Alright. Now what is this family tree? A family tree shows the relationship between different members of the family. In the family you have paternal grandparent, maternal grandparent. Then, so a family tree, what does it show? Relationship. Family tree shows relationship. It shows relationship between members. Members. Relationship between members of the family. Different members. It shows relationship between different members of the family. A family tree heads. Yes, which, who is the head of the family tree? It's always grandparent. And they are called the first generation. So, when you talk about family tree, normally, first you write down grandparents. In the family tree, grandparents come first. Okay, now who are they? Dada Ji and <clears throat> Dada Ji and Dada Ji. Okay. Now, when when you say grandfather, when you say grandfather, you call him Dada Ji. Okay. Dada Ji. When it is grandmother, that is grandfather, grandmother, what would you call her? Again. She is also Dadi Chi. Dadi Chi. Dadi Chi. Okay. Now they are the first generation. Now what do we call these people, these grandparents? We call them. What are they? They are the first generation. First they belong to the first generation. Okay, then follows the others. Let's look at the others. Now let us say you have dad and mom. Okay, now from these people let us say you have your, your dad and mom. Okay, when you talk about dad and mom, okay, now let us say dad and mom, they have, let's say they have a sister. So what do you be the sister? Buaji. Okay? Buaji, so dad has got a sister. Okay, that's a sister. Now, supposing dad has got a brother. If dad has got a brother, then, so he's got a brother. Dad has got a brother. We call him Cha Cha Ji. And that is the brother of dad. And in that case, that aunt will be Chachi Ji.
all right and then this sister of your dad has got a husband he will call he'll be called fuaji fufa g okay now these people we call them the second generation so this is the first generation so these people are second they are the second generation okay now they have their own family too now these people the fuaji and buaji they have children okay then they have a brother or two children they have shreya supposing they have two children all right now they have two children let's say okay then you have here shreya and nak that is theirs all right these two then let's say your dad and mum who do you have your dad and mum is got kera and here is the place for kera kera and ar so here you have kera and she got an elder brother his name is ar ar okay so that's it then these uncle and aunt they also have children and what do you call them they also have two children that is shaji sahi 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 ji and jyoti so now when we look at this these are the third these two these two these two they are the third generation who are they they are the third generation first generation grandparent your mothers and fathers people they are the second generation and the third comes your cousin you and your cousins and all together okay so that is a family tree what we have drawn up is family tree children of your father's brother or sister and your mother's brother or sister they are all your cousins so your dad's brothers and sisters children, all the shreya nak shaj jyoti all these are who are they they are all your cousins okay they become kheras cousin okay now what i am asking you now is what does the family teach us what does the family teach us that's our next question okay what does what does the family what does the family teach us what does the family teach us it's a very important question all right now being a part of the family the family makes us feel safe you feel very safe in your family protected in your family we learn sharing from an early age sharing sharing from a very early age as young as you are you are taught to share you get one sweet eat half give half to your brother like that so learning to share from early age 
Our family is the first place of learning. Learning takes place. You, the learning takes place first. They say the first school is your own family. Then, it teaches us many good values. So, what does the family teach us? The family, we feel safe, we learn to share, we do a lot of learning and we cultivate lot of values, important values. Next, what kind of values when you say, what are the different types of values you cultivate? Helping. Yes, you learn helping. Helping each other, only then you help people outside. Helping is a good value. Helping each other in the family and learning to work in a team. When you learn to help, then you work in a team. You learn to work in a team. Next, you learn to be humble. Some be still proud and sit there. No, you learn humility to be humble with each other. Then, you learn to take care of all your needs and help others also. Care for your things. Care for the object that you have. Care for the needs of the family. So, care for the needs, others' needs. Care for the needs of family. Thinking of others cultivated in our, in our own home. Kaira gets up early in the morning. And wishes everyone good morning. That's a good value. To her parent, to her brother. When grandparents visit the house, her parents touch, she touches the feet of the grandparents and gets their blessing. Kaira's mother says, it is a custom in the family to take blessings of the elders by touching their feet and getting, getting them to wish you well in life. So that's what we learned. We are talking about family tree. In family, you learn relationship and between members. Grandparents, they are the first generation. Dad, brother and sister, they are the second generation. Their children are the cousin and they are the third generation. What does a family teach us? We feel safe in our family. We learn to share in the family. We learn to do learning in the family. We learn a lot of values like helping so that we work in a team. We learn to be humble in the family. We care for the needs of the family. All these things we learn in a family.